I enjoyed bench research very much. I liked working with the, the animals, but I started doing a project um, with Jeff Stark at Texas Children's and really found that the, the world approach of infection prevention resonated with me. It's a team sport. We're all working to make things better for a defined population of patients. Uh, and my ID brain always thought holistically uh, about the whole patient and all the systems and the family and community surrounding the patient. And that just was a really natural um, transition to the public health in the hospital setting. And I guess that's one of the things that's so fantastic about ID is there's so much flexibility in what you can do with your non-clinical time. I love that I get to hang out with colleagues who are doing amazing basic science research that's really pushing things forward. And I have colleagues who are working on vaccine trials and you know clinical um, drug trials to improve our prevention and treatment of infections. I am definitely firmly in that ID camp that loves the NICU and loves babies. Uh, and so I really do enjoy working with the, the neonatal patients and the families and helping them you know, talk through what does the diagnosis of a congenital infection mean or what does this group B, right, strep meningitis mean for your um, child's outcome and the sort of limitless hope and possibility that is still there. But I think that one of the great things about ID is I can see all of those things that I, I know and I love and I feel comfortable with, um, but I'm still seeing things that I've never seen before um, or underlying conditions that are new to me or you know, drug resistant patterns that I haven't had to do with. So there's always this continual challenge.